Hello again, boys and girls. Um, you'll see I'm dressed a little bit differently today because today we're going to be talking about the battery pack. And the battery pack is a little more dangerous than looking at a wheel cover. So what we're going to do is we're going to start out by looking at the battery pack housing itself. It's not hard to see that this is very much the same as the Model 3 battery pack. Every hole uh, no matter where it is, is identical on the, on the new Model Y. What we can look at is uh, some differences. So let's have a look at what first difference we've got is the bulb seal that used to be around the outside edge of the battery pack for the Y, that, or sorry, on the, uh, on the Model 3 is gone. You can see the uh, scrapings from where it was. And it's been replaced by uh, the, the smaller uh, foam pack that uh, that's needed because of the because of the irregular shapes that uh, that comes as a result of putting it into the uh, casting and you can see the witness marks uh, right here there's the witness marks that show what's going on there's a couple of good ideas though they've uh, eliminated they've eliminated uh, the, the fiber padding that we've got so this would be die cut and in place of that, they put in these um, foam, uh, foam isolators. So that's a big cost reduction. <clears throat> so let's, uh, let's have a look at something else that I really, really like. This is the same as what they had on the Model 3, but when you, when you can put something on as quickly as what I'm doing and keeping it rigid, this is great for operators. This is a, a fabulous idea that the, uh, the folks at, uh, at Tesla have come up with. It keeps everything as, uh, as tight as possible. So now let's, uh, <clears throat> let's have a look at um, the business end here. <clears throat> so first off, let's look at the battery cover itself. Uh, this is identical. We mentioned that before, uh, be and we know that because these are the, um, these are the attachments for the Model 3 seat. They, uh, they changed the, uh, the port over here. We talked about this before as well. That, uh, that port used to be made out of a, 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 a plastic, but now it's, um, now it's made out of aluminum. Let's have a check of these. These are identical as well. These are tamper-proof bolts. They uh, are not easy accessible. The, you can't just run to your hardware store and buy some, um, something, something off the shelf for these. And Yes, I am puffing and painting because I'm hotter than blazes. So we've got two interlock bolts that we need to, uh, to talk a little bit about. These are the ones right here and here. These are the uh, safety interlocks. These bolts actually complete the circuit that goes in, well, it's completed by the, uh, by the aluminum cover. <clears throat> so that's your low voltage connector. Now it's time to take the lid off. So. Uh, let me just get rid of this thing. <clears throat> okay, and this is the reason for all of the paraphernalia that I'm wearing, because this stuff's uh, live. So let's look at the, the big silver box here. This is the uh, charge module. This is the DC-DC converter. So this will take your high and low voltages and uh, Separate them and send them where they need to go. The, uh, the low voltage DC output um, is, is visible, is visible right here. So the 12 volt uh, red wire goes all the way out to, the, um, out to where the uh, 12 volt battery is. Now let's uh, have a look at the uh, two interconnection safety switches, one here and one over here. So also on the safety aspect, this is the pyro switch. Uh, if you're in a crash, um, that thing um, basically blows up and destroys the circuit between the two halves of the battery, cutting your voltage in half immediately. See this uh, black box right here? Um, this is collecting all of the low voltage systems, or signals I should say, that are monitoring the uh, temperature, voltage, and safety inter uh, of the interconnects. If we look over here, you can see that we've got a little t sticker that says this is from the uh, Model 3. And that's how we know when we've got uh, similar parts. You can see that the, 
you can see that uh, if you have a look right here, these are the battery control modules that uh, we're going to find, I think, when we start opening up the, uh, the case. The case will uh, probably have four of these, one for each one of the main modules that you're going to find underneath here. So they eliminated the AC filter harness uh, trough, so that's gone. They eliminated the fuse protector. So over here, we can see that there's um, some fuses that are exposed. These fuses used to have a cover on them. That cover is now gone. And the, uh, they eliminated uh, the two terminal caps from uh, the high voltage safety switches. So uh, it's been a, a real hoot to try and take this thing to pieces. And we're hoping to bring you more information as soon as we possibly can. Thank you and have yourself a great day. Bye now.